Okay, so let's be really real here. A lot of people say you have to use AI tools to grow your business or be left behind. Now, I don't know that's necessarily true, but I do think it's a mistake not to embrace AI tools strategically. So what I'd like to do today is share two num worst ways that to learn AI and what a lot of people default to and the number one best way to learn to use AI. I've got a little cheat sheet that will help you embrace the strategy that I'm going to share with you. So let's talk about the worst it is looking around at other people talking about software they're using and jumping around and trying this software. <laughs> don't need to be trying out all the different software because they don't serve your business. So you're jumping around, you're pretending you're productive, but really you're just messing around creating maybe some cool looking stuff, but isn't it growing your business? Also buying those packages of prompts, hundreds of prompts, thousands of prompts. I've seen, for goodness sakes, I've even seen 15,000 prompt collections. That is not what you need. You need strategy. You need substance to what those prompts are going to do for your business and not a billion choices so that you don't know what to do next. So the number one way to use AI is to simply view it as a collaborator and consult it every time you get stuck in your business. So whether you're not sure what kind of content to produce, what topics, you don't know how to organize your course, so you need help with an outline. You're not sure how to phrase something for your sales page. You're not sure what the, like the big benefits or the great hook you could use to sell your product on your sales page could be. You don't understand your audience properly. All these things, every time you run into something where you're a little bit stuck, you go to AI. Man, I, even when you're stuck and using so many popular softwares and you can't find the, the answer in the help file, sometimes ChatGPT can find them for you. So find the AI tool that works best for you, like ChatGPT, Cloud Grump. I don't care which one it is. I use ChatGPT. That's just like saying Kleenex. That's what I mean. Find one, work with it. It will lead you to other places. Perhaps when it sees some of the problems you're having in your business, it will recommend some software that is AI. And then you are using it strategically in your business because you need it. Before that, you don't need it. You don't need to try everything out. If you'd like to develop this habit where that means you're going to have more clarity, you're going to do things faster, you're going to get things done, and you're going to create, that's the real focus for me too, is creating better experiences for our customers, making our content better, making what we say speak to them better. That is key. So you're going to get great at all that when you develop this collaborator habit. If you'd like a little cheat sheet to help you incorporate this collaborator habit into your business, I've got that for you. 